If you've ever wanted to learn how plants are used in the creation of adult beverages, we've got the perfect event for you, as long as you're 21 or older, that is. You're invited to join Durham Parks and Recreation and Durham Distillery for a botany bar crawl on Saturday, February 25th from 3 to 5 p.m. You'll get to venture outdoors first for a lesson in the botany behind your favorite drinks. Afterward, you'll return to the distillery for a tour and tasting, highlighting the science behind the drinks. Durham Distillery is located at 711 Washington Street. Pre-registration is required, and the cost is $6 for residents and $11 for non-residents. An additional fee for the facility tour and sampling may apply. For more details, visit the calendar for February 25th at dprplaymore.org and follow DPR on social media. The new rooftop solar array at our General Services building is already helping us deliver on our carbon neutrality and renewable energy action plan goals. Located at 2011 Fay Street, the system uses 303 solar panels. It's expected to generate 157,000 kilowatt hours of clean, green, renewable energy every year. That's equal to 111 metric tons of greenhouse gas emissions, the same amount produced by the annual energy usage of 14 American homes. It's also the same amount of greenhouse gas emissions produced by driving a gas-powered car from Durham to Los Angeles and back 55 times. More details on all of our sustainability and energy management efforts, visit durhamnc.gov 822. Entries for our 2023 Water Conservation Poster Contest are now being accepted. The annual contest is held by our water management team to encourage children to use their artistic talents to celebrate drinking water and to promote water conservation. It's part of the celebration of National Drinking Water Week, which will be observed this year from May 7th to the 13th. The poster contest is a way to bring attention to the importance of water as a resource and to encourage Durham's young artists to express their own ideas about this year's theme of Save Blue, Live Green. Any Durham resident in grades kindergarten through eighth grade is eligible to participate. All poster entries must be submitted digitally by March 25th, and the public voting will be held from March 26th to April 15th. The winner from each grade category will be announced by May 1st. More details can be found at durhamsaveswater.org and at Durham Water on social media. If you're looking for a summer experience that your child will never forget, mark your calendar now to register them for Durham Parks and Recreation's 2023 summer camps. DPR offers a variety of traditional summer day camps for children ages 5 to 12. They'll enjoy fitness fun, arts and crafts, friendship building activities, swimming, day trips, and much more. In addition, the Teen Summer Connect Camp will offer age-appropriate activities for teens ages 13 to 17. All camps will be held from June 20th through August 18th. Registration will begin on Monday, March 13th at 9 a.m. and is available on a first-come, first-served basis. Participants can register online, in person at DPR's administrative building, or at any DPR Recreation Center. More details can be found at dprplaymore.org 366 or through social media. Do you need to stay in the know about Go Durham service changes? If so, you can sign up for Go Durham service alerts. These alerts will give you the most up-to-date information about detours, holiday reminders, and anything else that might affect when and how GoDurham operates. To sign up, click on service alerts in the upper right corner at godurhamtransit.org. You can also call 919-485-RIDE or download the MyStop app in the Apple App Store through Google Play or through the GoDurham website. The app lets you track your bus, trips, and schedule alerts. In addition to all of these options, GoDurm service updates will always be posted on social media.